remember what the haters talking about. Yeah. What's up, family? Steven Spielberg's daughter gave a tell-all interview about being sexually assaulted growing up and her aspirations to be a sex worker. Michaela Spielberg is pursuing a career in sex work family. In a candid interview, she revealed she has been making solo porn videos for Pornhub and aspired to dance in a strip club as soon as she got her sex worker license. She said, I got really tired of not being able to capitalize on my body and frankly, I got really tired of being told to hate my body. Also, I just got tired of working day to day in a way that wasn't satisfying my soul. I feel like doing this kind of work, I'm able to satisfy other people, but that feels good because it's not in a way that makes me feel violated. Michaela, who lives in Nashville, Tennessee, said both her parents, Steven Spielberg and actress Kate Capshaw, were supportive and intrigued by her career choice. She said she didn't want to be dependent upon them because it would not make her feel comfortable. She continued, this is a positive, empowering choice. I realize there's no shame in having a fascination with this industry and wanting to do something that is safe, sane, and consensual. She said she would never have sex with someone else on camera because of her relationship with her partner, 47-year-old professional darts player, Chuck Pankow. The reason I don't want to do anything outside of solo stuff is because I feel like it would be a violation of my boundaries and my relationship with my significant other. Michaela also opened up about her difficult past, saying she had been sexually abused by predators for years. She didn't give any details, but she did say these were not friends or members of her family. The abuse subjected her, she said, to years of mental health problems, including anorexia, borderline personality disorder, and alcoholism. Some of her problems started when she was sent to boarding school, she said, adding that she didn't blame her parents because they couldn't have known. She said she was really out of control from 11 years old up until about two years ago. She's 23 years old now. So we're talking about 12 years that young lady went through hell. Michaela was adopted by Steven Spielberg and Kate Capshaw back in 1996, and she is among their seven adopted children. From what I'm hearing, this started at the boarding school. This happens way more than anybody might even think. These boarding schools have this facade of being nice and prestigious, pristine and proper. So people tend to like relate that with good. And oftentimes, it's simply a facade. Get you to relax your guards. As soon as you take off, man, they are doing all kind of evil stuff to your children. You got to be very, very careful about taking your kids anywhere and dropping them off, let alone for weeks at a time, sometimes months at a time, people don't see their children. Man, Michaela said that her parents, both of her parents have been supportive and are intrigued by her career choice. This may very well be Steven Spielberg's best acting job because I really don't believe that he's that supportive. I, th I think it might be a situation where there's some guilt there. And he's like, well, I don't want to like 
hurt her any more than she's been hurt. So if that's what she wants to do, then I guess I'll just, I have to be okay with that. Borderline personality disorder sounds rather innocuous. However, it is anything but. This is a sad story. But this is a grown woman now. And this is the career path that she has chosen. I'm talking about somebody who is privileged. And I know what those Spielberg fans are thinking. Like she's dragging the Spielberg name. Perhaps that's why she's going by Sugar Star. But she's not going to be able to separate from that name. She's not going to be able to put any distance between her and the Spielberg name. I mean... They're going to come looking for In fact, some of y'all looking right now. Y'all searching right now. Y'all be careful out there, fam. Love on them kids, man. Keep them close. Be suspicious of everybody. Investigate everybody. You owe it to your babies. No more talk. What the ladies talking about? Yeah.